Based in the Norwegian capital of Oslo, Kahoot is considered one of Europe's most valuable edtech outfits after earning elusive unicorn status in 2020. The company offers a platform for user-generated learning games and trivia quizzes available in 11 different languages. What is the value in game-based and social learning? So we believe that making learning awesome is all about this, to really make sure that everyone gets a great software platform to share their knowledge. We have 9 million teachers on the platform using Kahoot, so this is definitely something that really makes a difference. You have that gamification aspect to online learning, which prompts the question, is it good to turn a classroom into a game show? It definitely is a good thing to make sure that everyone gets involved. And one of the strengths of the Kahoot platform is that everyone can, if you will, be visible, whether you are in the back of the class not talking too much, or if you are on the front row and always raising your hand. Eilert Hanoa took the helm at Kahoot in 2019. He says that gamified learning could be a way to make education more engaging. And many teachers seem to agree. The company says more than 1.5 million educators use the platform each week. We believe that having software that makes you lean into the session instead of leading back and zoning out is definitely very important. And maybe more important now with back to school to re-engage and get all this interest and engagement back into the group. For Hanoa, the game-based learning concept is designed to be a digital tool or a companion to the curriculum. Now see more than ever that the need for a digital platform for learning, whether the class is back in school or hybrid learning or still in lockdown, is more important than ever. Do you think gamification will play an increasingly important role in education going forward? We don't believe that gamification will be increasingly important, but it will be one of the ingredients that makes it more interesting and compelling. The most important is, of course, the pedagogic aspect. Teaching happens through stories, narrative, um, uh, analogies, and so um, that type of framework works well in helping students deeply learn. Point eighty-five times With its short-form videos and deep learning algorithm, Numerate is an artificial intelligence tutor based in LA that seeks to match different teaching styles to how an individual student learns. The company says that 20 million students worldwide have used the platform to brush up on topics from multiplication to quantum mechanics. If you look at you know TikTok or YouTube, it's, it's the same type of concept, but the, the difference here from a learning standpoint is that students have their own space and their own time to, to, to review the, the concepts and the videos at their own pace. We have over 1.5 million short form videos, uh, in addition to 17 actual courses within STEM. Right? So um, getting back to the theme of, you know, we want to digitize uh, every single student, uh, educator, or teacher's knowledge into this, this short form video to make, uh, to make it more accessible to all students. And a final question, is your technology a tech for good and why? Making a great learning platform free forever for teachers, students, and parents. We believe that we can do a difference uh, in making learning awesome. And a final question from me. Divya, is your technology a tech for good and why? Definitely a tech for good because if you see the number of students who are able to continue learning, then literally everything stopped for them. Learning didn't. It's only because of technology. I emphatically believe that this is tech for good. Well, learning is always good. And technologies that support new ways of learning and technologies that support critical thinking and technologies that support making the world a better place, I think they are for good. We hope to be sort of like an enabler of even more technology being created for good. It is certainly a tech for good. If we accomplish half of what we are hoping we will accomplish with Moxie for Children, I think we will have made a difference.